Hi, and welcome back to Let's Try. I had to unfortunately record this after the fact because my Adobe Sound Booth, which I'd had been using, has suddenly decided to completely die. It won't record my voice for anything. In any case, so I'm going to have to do this with a regular sound recorder. I have no idea how this is going to come out, and I'm doing this right before work, which really sucks because I'm going to have to rush a shower now right after this is done. In any case, here we go. We're going through level one. Uh, when I was a kid, I used to be able to do this whole game. Um, without uh, getting killed, but uh, I really don't think I can do that anymore. Um, if I can, it'll be a miracle. Um, this is a pretty... I'm not... This is not a speed run, per se. There's no tools being used. The only thing I'm using uh, uh, to even do this with is I have a converter port for my computer. It lets me utilize uh, NES controls. So I'm using an NES uh, Max control. And it does have a turbo feature, and you see that kind of up and coming this is a short video as I said, I've got to get to work. Um, this is just level 1 and 2 of the original Contra. And no, I haven't stopped my other Let's Plays. Um, not at all. Um, so here we go. And we're going to see um, me move pretty quickly here um, as I try to take this boss out. Um, we're going to take out the guy on top, as you already saw. Now we're going to go for each one of the guns. Um, Taking those guns out is a pretty simple task, it's not a big deal. Rip the guns apart, then we're going to take out uh, this thing at the bottom. And I don't know why I didn't just lay down there. Instead I decided to jump around like a retard, but hey, boss is dead, we're going to go on. Uh, and I'm jamming start here to keep this thing going as fast as possible. Maybe I'll have time to do both. Uh, I've never really time, so I never realized how long this might take. Um, not that long, this is a really short video. Um, run forward and here. Uh, I always start with the right side of the screen on every one of these because most of the time the right opens up for the left. So we're going to take out the right side here. We're going to take out the left side here. One bullet is fired. We take out the center. And thanks to the power of the ungodly spreader, we are not even going to be touched by these punks. Alright. That spreader is just the ultimate lifesaver here. Of course, you can duck to avoid bullets. Uh, that doesn't help you against grenades, so we're going to go right, we're going to go left, and then I'm going to start sucking, because I can't hit that thing in the center. Oh god, I don't know why, uh, even though I'm recording this after the fact, this is still stressful. F, that is a shitty weapon, by the way. That weapon is complete ass. That, I don't know the name of it, I always called it the Fireball Launcher, and it is, the F actually stands for fuck, because it's a fucking piece of shit. No joke. So here we got to take these uh, flashing red things out to make our boss appear. Uh, I recommend you take those cannons out. You do not want to get shot at while you're trying to take this boss down. With the cannons toast, rip the center apart with the power of the spreader. Nothing here can possibly stand a chance. As you shoot, 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 and boom, there you go. The boss is toast, and we can move on to level three. But I don't have time to record that now. In fact, I got to go grab a shower, then get out of here and go to work. It was a pleasure. Have fun.